In this video, I'm going to show you how to make really detailed molds for polymer clay. I'm using Amazing Mold Putty, and it comes in two parts. One is yellow and one is white, and you just mix together equal parts. To make the cupcake mold, I just pressed the base and the putty, and then pulled the putty up around the edges. And then you want to squeeze the edges to make sure that all the little ridges are filled with the putty. And you want to squeeze the bottom. This mold is really difficult because there are so many little tiny details in the waffle and it's really hard to get them. But the way that I found that works the best is you just basically take a little bit of the putty and smash it into the top and pull it apart at the edges. But basically you just want to smash some of the putty on the top of the waffle and press it into all the little details and then take away the excess from the edges. And then you want to mix up some more mold putty and this is going to go on top of that. And now I'm just pressing the waffle into the extra putty and then it's all going to stick together and make one mold in the end. And this one is a little hot dog bun. And I started by making a long pointy little shape and that's going to fill in the center of the bun. And you just want to press them together to start making this mold. You just want to make sure that the bun is still visible. You don't want the mold putty to go all the way over the bun. And this heart waffle is a little bit harder because the edges have a lot of detail too and that can be hard to pick up in a mold. But basically you just want to do the same thing, just press a lot onto the top and kind of pack it on and make sure you fill in all the little details and ridges. And then after you do that, you want to take some more mold putty and put it on top of that. If you want your molds to set quickly, you can put them in a warm place or use a hair dryer to warm them up and that'll make them dry really quickly. And this is what all the molds look like once they're all finished. And you can see all the detail, they're all perfect. And here are all your pictures from Facebook and Instagram and thanks again for sending them to me.